Let's go to Norfolk. Hello, Robin. Oh, hi, how are you? We're well, thank you. Yourself? Yeah, very well. A bit nervous first time calling. You're, you're very welcome, Robin. You're very you're welcome. welcome. So, whether you can help me, I'm, I wouldn't even say I'm a, a professional or even really an amateur gardener as such, but I inherited a lot of cactuses. Um, I don't know if they're actually cacti plurals. It's cacti um, plural, yeah. <laughs> is it? Yes, yeah, yeah. So, um, I heard a woman call them cactum, but I, de- I de- corrected her for that. I have about 40 of them and quite large. Now, my problem is they're in the bathroom that they are covered in nits or little creatures. Now, could they have come, because the person that gave me, Martin Bell, had, um, he had told me that he did have head lice. Could it have, could it be transference? I can't get rid of them. What, how can you help? Um, if, you're, if, you're, if your scalp isn't itching, it's definitely not the head lice. Right. Um, are they like little, sm- are they like minute flies, little black flies? They're little, they're sort of like little, um, beetle type things and in they're so close that you can almost they either it, it's like they emit a shrill little noise as well when they move right uh, it's sort of ear very loud and it's quite d- distressing when you get in there because the noise is sometimes deafening in it because it's a bathroom in it and i don't know what they are right they um, make a very shrill a high-pitched deafening noise and it's very distressing every time I have a bath or have a shower because of the nits are making this almost as if they're sending a sound ray around the room. I don't right. know what they are. Okay, well, the first thing I would do is um, spray the whole lot with... Um, bleach. Sorry, you're breaking up. Spray them with bleach, did you say? No, no, I, I would spray them. That's the last thing I would spray them with. Um, there's a product called Provado. Bravado, hold Pro, on. It's PR, Bravado, and it's the aerosol form that you want. That should kill off the insects and basically stop them screaming. Does that remove all the noise? If you kill the insects, it should remove the noise, yes. Right, and is it ethically right to destroy the creatures because they have lived families and children themselves? Well, well, that's your choice, Robin. Yes, isn't it? exactly. You know, it's up to you, my friend. <laughs> oh, the baby beetles. Uh, well, it's up to you. You pay your money. You take your choice. It's whether how badly you want to get rid of them. And would you, would you would I have to do a little prayer for the baby beetles? You can if you want. Oh, okay. Then I will. Robin, thank you for your call.